Hi all, today we will discuss on installment payment terms along with APP. First and foremost what you have to do, you have to create one master payment term along with installment payment terms. Suppose you need to create two installments. First installment 50% in 30 days, second installment another 50% in 60 days. In this case, you have to create three payment terms. One is master, another one is first installment and second installment. These two installment, you have to link it to the master payment term. Let us see how shall we do that. First and the foremost, let us go to decode OBB8. Then click on new entries. Then we will give Z zero M M. So we can give our own explanation. Fifty percent in thirty days. Next fifty percent in sixty days. Then this is on the document date. Then please note you have to enable installment payment term. Other than that, you don't have to do anything here. Now click on save. Then I'll go to next. Then Z O M one. So this is I'll create fifty percent in 30 days okay then document date so here just you have to give 30 then everything you have entered click on save then go to next z o m 2 so 50% in 60 days so please make sure this is 60 <coughs> ZOM2 already existed you can make it 3 okay then click on save now you have to link this two installment to the master installment how you have to do you have to go to OB B9. Press enter. Click on new and trace. Now you have to select the master one. So master one, what you have selected? This is Z O M M is the master one. Then this is the first installment. Then this is fifty percent. Then press here four here. Then select. I think we had given that go M1. So click on search Z please select Z go M then press enter again Z M M then second installment then fifty then go m2 sorry 3 you have to select here so now click on save now we will create one vendor master so a01 you have to enter company code account group and select company you can give vendor master installment payment term test so you can give street
then house number then postal code then city then country hi then go to next next okay give all these details go to next give a reconciliation account next payment term you have to select zvo mm you have to select the master one okay this is the one you have to select then payment method D. Now click on save. So vendor number is one double zero four zero four. Now we will test this. Now we will go to FB zero one. What we will do? We will give one month prior date because it has to calculate as a due date. So ten seven. I am going to give. Then thirty one. I will select four one double zero four zero four. So posting period. This is the warning. That is not an issue. I am going to give ten thousand and payment method T. Then I am going to select forty. Select the account. Give the star. Then go to document. Simulate. Please note, this ten thousand has been divided into two installment because we have agreed with the vendor fifty percent in thirty days, another fifty percent in sixty days. Let us go and check FBL one n. Go and execute. Now we will check the net due date. Select this. See, one is nine eight, another one is eight nine. One is August, another is September. Okay. Now let us run F hundred and ten for this. Run seventeen. I click on parameters. I'll go to additional log. Then do date check. Payment method in all cases. I click on save. Okay. Then I'll come to status. Let us go to proposal. We can start immediately. Keep on pressing enter. Still, proposal has been created. You have to keep on pressing enter or refresh. Please note, I'll be providing you sessions on production support in coming days. Kindly. Watch those sessions. It will be very helpful. Proposal has been created. We'll go and check the proposal. 
see this proposal has been done so double click on this see posting date is 107 document date is also 107 so one month due this is taken for the payment so another 5000 it will not consider because that is not due now let us go to payment run so one generated one completed now let us go and check in fbl1 and see it is showing only 5000 let us go and check all items see this one payment has been done for 5000 okay only the due is 5000 so this how you can able to do the installment payment terms along with app thank you for watching and listening my demo